I found NFTs and they immediately started making sense to me because I had been playing Fortnite for the previous few months before. Uh, and I just saw how much money kids were spending on skins and you know, how, how much they really loved it. And I was like, yeah, well, you know, what better way to prove you own something that's scarce than to have like this online digital record of it through blockchain. Like this is literally what blockchain is for. So I started going down the, the rabbit hole there. Um, I ended up, uh, you know, I guess becoming pretty notable in late 2020, early 2021. I ended up doing a collaboration with Adidas at the end of 2021. And after that, um, I turned to my team. I was like, all right, well, like I wanted to launch a uh, luxury fashion brand. I had wanted to launch a fashion brand from when I entered into the space. Mm -hmm. I just thought it was still a little too early uh, to do that. Um, at that point in time, because even though, um, you know, there was a lot of talk of the metaverse, not many people were hanging out in the metaverse outside of like Roblox uh, and um, and Fortnite. Mm -hmm. So um, it was at that point that I was like, I want to I want to start a brand. I want to link it with NFTs. Right. I have NFC chips. Uh, we put NFC chips on all of the products linked to NFTs, uh, because as a consumer, that's something that I want to see right mm -hmm. out there of like, you know, if I buy something that's limited edition, I would like to know how many of them, like verifiably, how many of them are in existence. So yep. that was kind of, you know, the, uh, the framework for launching 90CC. And then, you know, it's obviously evolved since then, because I do think um, the, like an NFC, a digital twin slash certificate of authenticity linked to a physical product is table stakes for what you can do with the tech. But what I find really enticing and really fun is working in the design space of how do you gamify that experience and build community around it. Awesome. I mean, there is so much content uh, there in, in what you just said. So um, first, I'm, I'm curious about why, why a luxury fashion brand? Why, why was your interest there? Is this something that um, because of the technology you thought it was uh, it made sense to connect it to more of a luxury brand or was it your interest? You wanted to go that route? What, why luxury uh, fashion brand? Yeah, I, I think that's a really great question. And honestly, I think it's, it's a mixture of both, right? I think obviously um, I, I had been quite successful in my career uh, up until that point um, and even more so uh, after getting into the NFT space. And so like, I, I do enjoy, you know, some of like the nicer brands out there, like the luxury items. I like them honestly myself. So like from the start, the framework of what I wanted to build is, and this is the way we, we do everything is like, is this something that I want? Is this something that I would want to wear? Is this something that I would want to do uh, or be associated with? Right. And I think at, at the time you have to remember this is late 2021, um, you know, board apes are probably at that point, the most viable NFTs in the market. There's a lot of PFP projects out there and like the products that existed was very, uh, like I, for lack of a better word is juvenile, right? Like very yeah. cartoon graphic -y. And so I wanted something, as, that I said, Hey, how can I show, right? Cause like at that time, what existed in the market was. I could either show that I'm crypto native by wearing like a graphic hoodie, right? Mm -hmm. That isn't necessarily what my aesthetic is, or I can go out and buy like Prada, Louis Vuitton, right? Uh, Christian Dior, stuff like that. That doesn't showcase that I'm a crypto native. And I was like, well, what about people like me that like, I do want to dress well. I want to have a well-made product, but I don't want it to be really loud and in your face. I want it to mm -hmm. be, subtle yeah. and like subdued right and that was kind of the basis for the brand 